Hello everyone, today I just wanted to talk about Mario Maker 2, some of my general thoughts, consensus, pros and cons about the whole thing. We just had uh, the initial trailer for it, some Japanese artwork footage, the 15 minute Nintendo Direct, we got E3 happening. Within the next few days we're going to learn more about it. Basically the pros, we got five new level kind of themes. We have the moon effects, slopes, that's probably the biggest announcement. The new Super Mario World theme, multiplayer, obviously some of the cons you've already heard before, they are no online friend matchmaking due to uh, affecting the uh, stat ranking. I think that's kind of stupid, who cares? I don't care about ranking, but I guess they do. Um, no amiibo support this time. No stage made level switch from the old four types of levels to the, uh, to the new theme. So you can't make a theme in the old theme and bring it over to the new theme, unfortunately. My personal thoughts on this game, though, is it can change in the future. This is a template. It's very much like Smash, where more new stuff will be added later as DLC down the road, which is kind of exciting. And like, say, maybe they don't support Amiibo now, but maybe they'll support in the future as part of DLC. Maybe there's characters in the Mario games that haven't been there in the past. It might come later as part of DLC bundles. So I'm kind of thinking that's what they're going to announce at E3, if not then, maybe... TGS or another one of their Nintendo Directs. That's why I think it's coming down the pipeline through Mario Maker. Um, let me know if you think that's true. Let me think if there's anything else I want to cover. I just want to cover, like, the general community's consensus. Like, all those people that play those crazy Kaizo levels that only, like, 30 people in the whole world can be, they'll love it. They'll find crazy things to do with it. Um... Yeah, like, just people that want simple fun levels, they'll be able to make those. They don't have to be crazy ones with spikes lined here and there. But yeah, I think it's a game for everyone, you know, just... Some people like to create, some people like to play, you know, take your own take on it. But like I said, it's a template. Expect to see a lot more worlds. Some people are thinking there's only going to be one more world theme, but I'm thinking it's going to be endless world themes. I'm thinking it's just a template, you know, very much like Super Smash Brothers for the switch it's a template there's more to come so i'm excited that's my thoughts i don't know if i'm right i'm kind of speculating right now but anyways let me know if you think this is correct too in the comments below and anyways e3 is going to happen so we'll let that be the ultimate judge or whatever nintendo does with their nintendo directs and anyways just thought i'd drop that by and everyone have a good day and bye